Hey everyone, Ricardo here, or rather Rabizi, and I'm with Mike Stelsner from socialmediaexaminer.com. Mike, how are you? Great, Ricardo. Thanks so much for having me. So, tell us a little bit about the background and kind of how Social Media Examiner was born. Where did the idea come from? Social Media Examiner happened over a dinner meeting, believe it or not, with uh, Mari Smith and Denise Wakeman. And uh, we were just brainstorming ideas, and I said, what do you think about starting a blog on social media? And they're like, another blog? I don't think so. So originally it wasn't received very well, but uh, it, that's how it started, just as an idea. And then we ended up going to Blog World, and I said, okay, if we're going to do this, let's do this. And uh, I recruited Chris Garrett and a number of other people to start writing posts for the thing, and it just exploded almost overnight. You've to date, you've recruited a sort of a large editorial. You have an editorial staff. You strive for editorial excellence. Right. Tell me a little bit about how that structure works. Basically, what we do is we have about 60 writers that write for us. Nobody gets paid. It's an exchange for exposure. Pardon the helicopter going over. <laughs> um, so what happens is uh, it has to be a mutual win-win for everybody. So if you're a blogger and you want to bring people to your site, they've got there's got to be something in it for them, and we make sure that everybody that writes for us wants exposure to marketers and to business owners, which is who we're targeting. But whenever an article comes through our site, uh, we vet the author to make sure their quality of writing is good. Uh, it goes through an entire editorial team. We have four editors who go through every single article, including myself, and we strive for magazine-style stuff. So it's how-to articles, it's case studies, it's interviews with experts, and uh, that's the kind of stuff our audience really goes crazy over. And you go for sort of a mix of the content, not just written, but video. That's true. You, you've done a lot of interviews yourself. That's true. What we do is we go to trade shows, and we find out who's on the roster, and then ahead of time we ask them if they'd be willing to do an interview. Since they're already there and they're presenting, it means that they're looking for public exposure. A lot of them are book authors, so we'll bang out five or ten interviews in a day, and that content is something we release over time on, on our blog, and it's a real successful That's a great method. strategy. Yeah. It keeps the uh, content fresh and coming. Absolutely. So tell me a little bit about, you have an upcoming book? Yes, it's called Launch. Subtitle is called How to Quickly Propel Your Business Beyond the Competition. And the gist of the book is about giving gifts to other people without expecting anything in return. I introduced a concept called the Elevation Principle, which is great content plus other people minus marketing messages equal growth. And in the book I talk about great content, there's primary fuel and nuclear fuel, and if your business is a rocket ship, Primary fuel is the stuff you regularly produce, and nuclear fuel is the big stuff, like the reports or the contests. And you need to do that and mix all that up, and that brings people to your site. But the thing most people don't do is they work with outsiders. So at Social Media Examiner, we're bringing in outsiders that are experts to write for us. We're interviewing experts. I'm on the microphone, you know, interviewing these mm -hmm. people at magazines and book authors. That brings a lot of great exposure to our site, and then the knowledge from the minds of these experts. The last thing is minus the marketing message. We don't market. We do a commercial free environment. Nobody likes to be sold. So what we've done is we've created something that is just truly a gift to people. What happens is they love it, they want to come back for more, and we use back channels to market, which is email. And we've got 80,000 subscribers on our uh, daily email blast that goes out. So let's talk about that for a second. It sounds like a lot of the principles in the book are from what you've gathered in your own experience in building exactly. Social Media Examiner. That's true. Can you tell us a little bit about the numbers behind the growth from when you originally started the idea? Yeah to where it is today? Social Media Examiner is just a little over 18 months old. Uh, we have 700,000 page views a month, 80,000 email subscribers. We have uh, 44,000 Facebook fans. I don't know, 50,000 Twitter fans. We're the number one small business in the, in the world according to Technorati. And we're one of the top 1,200 websites in all of the United States according to Alexa. And all we did was follow these principles that I'm talking about with you right now. It's so much for just starting another social media blog, huh? Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Mike, tell us where we can find you on the web and where we can find uh, info about your upcoming book launch. Elevationprinciple.com will get you to the book where you can find a free chapter and socialmediaexaminer.com is where you can find out more about what we're doing and kind of check it out and see how it can work for your business. Thanks, Mike. Thank you.